How's it going? I'm Dan Rest and this is Doran Durling and we're with HBK Engineering and we're here at the Roundtable Live 2019. We're going to be doing a demonstration of taking record shots on a horizontal directional drill or directional bore. And first we're going to start off with getting GPS coordinates on some control points. That'll put us on a coordinate system that's universal that we can translate to any state plane or latitude longitude. And then we're going to set up our total station get that all going and then once they start their drilling we are going to take record shots on the bore as it happens. Badger first as part of the drilling process is going to pothole the utilities make sure that we're going to avoid them with the bore and then electric conduit construction is going to go ahead and do the bore they're going to locate it as they go along and put paint marks on the ground that's where we come in and survey those shots get those coordinates that I spoke of and then once they're through with their bore, they're going to pull back the conduit and then the conduit will be in the ground and they'll put tracer wire in there with that so that it could also be located via traditional radio locating methods as well. The GPS unit is what we actually use to get those coordinates that Dan was talking about. Uh, we transfer that information into the data collector for the, the robotic total station. Um, and then that is what allows us to, to go around and take individual measurements on um, anything that we need to. In today's case, it'll be the paint marks for the record survey of, of where this uh, particular duct is going to drop. And then the last step in the process will be putting the data into the computer, putting it in AutoCAD, and, and we'll show you the actual data as it comes in. You can see the, the record line of where that bore actually went versus the design, and that'll show you, and those are those coordinates that we can always get back to where that conduit is actually located. Okay, so I'm set up here. I've got the, the prism that's part of the total station set up. Uh, my colleague Doran is set up down on the corner on one control point. I'm set up on another one. And these are the control points that Doran just uh, got coordinates on with the GPS. Doran's gonna orient the total station, then he's gonna do what's called a back sight where he takes a shot on me at this other control point and that tells the total station its position, its orientation. Uh, and then we'll be ready to go ahead and shoot the directional bore marks that get put on the ground. So now I gotta go up a little bit and I'll tell him that my elevation is at 7.6 and he will shoot it at 7.6. Each one of these little X's represents one of the shots that we took on the record data. They are a little bit off from the design, and that's the normal you know, construction field differential that you get. But these shots now represent a, a state plane coordinate, which can be translated to latitude and longitude, or any other type of coordinate that can be put into GIS or any other type of global georeference coordinate system. So that's really the process uh, from setting up our, our equipment, getting our, our control reference points, and then shooting in the, the actual drill, and that then gives us coordinates that we can always get back to using the same type of equipment for you know, utility owners or, or anyone else that might need to know where those things are at in the future. It's not pulled off of curbs or right-of-way lines or anything else. If those things change in the future, you can always get back to, the, to where your facilities are um, using this, these techniques. So HBK Engineering can provide a full service uh, utility uh, design, field record measurements, locating. Basically, we can take you from inception of your project to the end of construction, documentation, and then locating in the field facility protection in the future. We can do it all. 